Good evening, Proxy. You're 35 seconds late. You can save those 17.5 one-handed push-ups for now. There's been some changes to our mission. Changes? Mr. Mole has a condition. He wants me to carry out this mission alone, instead of with his and his rebels' support. Since we've got the famous faith in, one person should be enough to handle it, is what he said. Hang on. That's fine if everything goes smoothly. But what if it doesn't? Affirmative. If we get caught, people will think Soldier 11 is a traitor. Master, we should suggest the client reevaluate the risk. Is that so? I suggest you reevaluate the risk. I said yes. <sighs> After considering it, with how cautious the rebels are being, saying no at this point would undoubtedly alarm them. There is no greater sin than betrayal. I'm willing to risk my life to find the traitor and bring them to justice. Then, you'll have to get your hands dirty. Right. I'm ready to go. I shall follow your order. Ready for combat. I'm at your disposal. One, two, yes. All accounted. I'll follow your instructions. Head maid Rena, at your. It's I have Awaiting further instructions. Ready and waiting. According to Soldier 11, the information on this weapon test is highly classified within the military. How did Mr. Mole get access to it at his rank? After all, he is not the owner of the strongest AI in New Eridu. Autonomous support unit, Lightfoot Rover. What a pain. We'll need to take down the main body, or else it'll continuously send drones after us. emergency switch. Just press here. <sighs> mm. Broken. 
Initiating backup plan. Come on, follow me. Stay focused. Forget the ethereals. This is it. Come over here. All right, we're here. The info the spy asked us to steal is right here. Am I the only one who can't see anything? Exactly. That's the effect I'm after. The Rebels want info on our armaments, specifically, data on one of the Defense Force's secret experimental weapons. The weapon itself was abandoned in this hollow after being damaged in an accident. Everything about it is top secret. If anyone outside the Defense Force, like you, were to ever see what it looked like, even just the damaged body, I'd have to arrange constant surveillance on you to ensure nothing related to it ever leaked. So the fact I'm helping you doesn't matter? It is exactly because you are my support that I need to make sure you don't see it. Ignorance will protect you. I'll finish this next part alone. Wait for me here. Oh, and search for an escape route. Not the way we came, but a different path. So cautious. Seems whatever Mr. Mole wants is something really important. And why does Soldier 11 want us to search for other escape routes? Wouldn't it be faster to just leave the way we came? Searching for an alternative path. Due to a large amount of corrupted intelligent machinery, the percentage of invalid data is abnormally high. I will require more time for an accurate calculation. Calculate in the background, Fairy. The client is back. Get down, and cover your ears. Roger. Three. Two, one. Obedient soldiers live longer. You've got some quick reflexes. Well done. I extracted the data we needed from the damaged experimental weapon, provided the remains weren't entirely corrupted. Such an action would activate its confidentiality procedure and start a self-destruct sequence. And that's exactly what happened. It was a loyal soldier, worthy of the Defense Force. Such a big explosion will attract enemies. It's not just the enemy I'm concerned about. My unit is wrapping up testing on a weapons experiment nearby. If the sound of the explosion leads unwitting teammates to follow the same path, recognize me, and thus question my loyalty. Perhaps you can't relate, but in the military, Loyalty is everything. That's why I wanted you to search for other escape routes. I don't want to be seen by anyone else right now. So, did you find another path? Negative. 38.65% remaining until an accurate calculation. But I can guide you as far as the area I've finished calculating. We've got a direction. Excellent. Let's move. The way back is no longer safe. Help us find another exit if you would, Proxy. If memory serves, let's try this way. Ethereal signal detected. Master, is running necessary when ambushing someone from behind? This will lead to revealing our location just like... Uh... Don't run through! 
face it head on? Here, the enemies are endless. Keep moving. Warning. High energy ethereal signal detected. Master, is running necessary? This will lead to reveal. Please note, an active military communication beacon was detected at this location. Presumably, a defense force remnant. I can use its communication network data to enhance the efficiency of my calculations, and thusly more quickly locate an escape route. The suggestion, reach this location by any means necessary. Um, isn't this a defense force communications beacon? That's right. We can use it. What do you need? Hmm. Use the Defense Force's communication beacon to assist in searching for an escape route from the Hollow. Very well. If it actually works. Are you sure? Communication data is highly sensitive. The Defense Force constantly cleans and updates it. The data in this beacon is probably outdated. If the real Faithen were here, they might be able to find some traces of confidential info on it. Luckily, you're just an imposter, so I don't have to worry about leaked secrets. I'm actually quite surprised it can be used to find an escape route. Hmm. I have mixed emotions. Was that a compliment or an insult? Challenge accepted. I will even obtain the Defense Force Commander-in-Chief's lock screen password. When did you become so competitive? Don't make things complicated. Just calculate an escape route. Comparing network data to filter out redundant information. New hollow escape route located. Filtering out redundant information. New hollow exit located. This is just a fake. The real faith in must be terrifying. Ethereal signal. Impressive. 
You maintained eye contact with an ethereal for over 10 minutes. You can surely beat your second assistant in your next staring contest. Fighting our time also sounds like a good option. My identity remains a secret. It's all thanks to you, Burgundy Silhouette. The bizarre code names keep coming. I'll add it to our business card. How does it feel to get your hands dirty? People wear gloves when their hands might get dirty. I'm just a glove for the Defense Force. Stains on a glove are no big deal. I don't want to pry, but you must have your own thoughts too, right? Betrayal is disgusting, but in the current circumstances, bearing this disgust is, in itself, a kind of true loyalty. Even if covered in this filth, I'd never mistake myself for a true traitor, if that's what you're asking. <laughs> 